We all know that business needs should drive software solutions. And in real business, everything is interconnected. Every meeting, task, document, and conversation are related to, say, a new project, a client, or a new business partnership. Ironically, most software serve only a single part of the puzzle, email for communication, document management for file sharing, calendaring software for meetings, and so on. When a team gets down to work, it is left switching back and forth between tools and manually moving information. We get lost in the means rather than focusing on the end. It should be no surprise then that today one of the biggest concerns amongst managers and experts is the problem of collaboration patchwork. There is general consensus that collaboration software, which is the digital backbone of a company, should consist of seamlessly integrated tools rather than being a mishmash of disjoint tools. Let me illustrate the power of this approach by managing a typical business situation through HyperOffice, the integrated collaboration suite I chose for my company. Before I start, let me introduce myself. I am Josh Griffin, and I own a small design firm in DC. I had been chasing a digital design project for Coke's new local campaign for months and finally won it. I just received an email from Kara, marketing manager at Coke, in my HyperOffice inbox. The email has instructions about the digital designs and has an attached detailed specs documents. Since HyperOffice includes cloud document management, the first thing I do is to save the document directly into the cloud so that it is immediately available to other members of the digital design team. This is a very important project for us and will kick off a number of activities internally. I use the email to task feature for this. A single click converts the email body into a task in the projects section. The email subject is set up as the task name and the email body as the task description. I really love this feature because as I'm sure you'll agree, a lot of emails are really tasks someone wants us to work on. I now deal with tasks as tasks, not in a sea of email. I set the timelines and priority for the task and assign it to Bobby and Dan who will own this project. I use the interlinking feature to attach the specs document I earlier saved to the cloud since they will need to reference it constantly. Next, I want us to have a closed door meeting together so that I can motivate my team and set expectations. I set up a calendar event, check everyone's schedules, and send out meeting invites right from the task. I also link the contact records of Kara and Sean to the task, the two people at Coke that my digital design team will need to be in touch with. I could do other things here as well, like set up a vote, start a discussion, or link it to another related task. Finally, I click on save and my team has everything it needs to work on the project. As you saw, because every tool in HyperOffice is interconnected, I could set up the entire collaboration framework for my team without even leaving my email. Imagine having to do it all through, say, four or five tools. And HyperOffice's power goes even beyond that. Sometimes, when I use Facebook, I used to think that activity walls and profiles are things I could use at work as well. That's where HyperOffice social features have taken my projects to the next level. Whatever we did in HyperOffice so far, I call structured collaboration. We have all the bits and pieces we need to complete the project, but we are still dependent on email to have conversations around the project and keep people notified of changes. This approach is therefore not the best at engaging workers. With HyperOffice social tools, we can finally stop emailing and start collaborating. I call this the conversational style of collaboration. With the structured parts set up, I now go to the digital design team wall and post a message to get the project started. I also attach the task and other structured components of the project to the message. Bobby and Dan get updates right on their activity walls and can post comments and have discussions around the task to drive it to completion. Anytime anything changes in the task, say someone updating the task status, everyone else is informed right on their walls. Our social walls have become our digital home where we communicate, keep track of things of interest, and jump in at the right moment to contribute. HyperOffice also caters to my needs when my team is on the road. Since I'm often on the road clinching business deals, I simply pull out my tablet and do much of what I mentioned earlier on HyperOffice's tablet interface. When someone in my team is traveling, they can sync HyperOffice email, calendars, and contacts with their phone and keep connected with work. Since HyperOffice works with most mobile devices, I just let everyone bring their own phones to stay connected. And there's more. 
HyperOffice doesn't just simply work inside the office, but connects me to the outside world as well. This is really important for us since we work with a lot of contractors. Before HyperOffice, we had no choice but to use email for this. Boy, that is a pain. But with HyperOffice, I can simply grab the items I want to share out and share this information with the world with a single click. For instance, there are additional samples of our work that I want to share with the folks at Coke. Also, since I run a transparent operation, I want them to have a view of our design task as it progresses. I select all these items, add Kara and Sean to the share, and just click on Share. Kara and Sean can instantly access this information without even having HyperOffice accounts. This also saves me from oops moments. If I shared wrong information initially, I can simply update it and be sure that Kara and Sean have the latest, most accurate information. This way, I keep full control over what I shared. And this goes further. Kara and Sean want to share this information with others, say with their reporting manager. They can do so on their own. As information goes further and further out, I am building my collaborative network. What I love about HyperOffice is that I don't have to worry about the how. I focus on finishing the task at hand, and whenever I need something, HyperOffice is right there with exactly what I need, simply, logically, effortlessly.